We are now three weeks and a day from the election. Good evening, I'm Quinesia Fraser. And I'm Bill Shammer. And as we inch closer to November 5th, polling in the Nebraska congressional and Senate races remains very tight. It's the same story when we look at the presidential race. According to a new ABC News Ipsos poll, Kamala Harris has 50% support to Donald Trump's 48% among likely voters in the national survey, but that falls within the margin of error. We have team coverage helping you make sense of all aspects of this election. Chris Rosales is in Washington with that new presidential polling. Waverly Monroe has new fallout from the KETV debate between Congressman Don Bacon and State Senator Tony Vargas. But first, we'll start with Alex McClune on the allegations of stolen campaign signs in the city of Omaha. Alex, what are police telling you? Bill Conicia, police say they have about two dozen reports of stolen or damaged political yard signs. It's private property that can be replaced. It's a sign of the times, leaving property owners with little indication of where they went. I just know that there are signs everywhere being stolen. Don Cook lives in north central Omaha, where people aren't afraid to show who they support. My wife told me that, you know, it's going to be stolen. Well, I was taking it in, and the one night that I didn't take it in, I forgot. And he's not the only one. Omaha police say they have about two dozen reports related to stolen or damaged blue dot, red dot, and other political yard signs this year. One report says someone noticed neighbors missing their Harris Walls placards in West Omaha. Another person reported at least 15 neighbors had theirs taken as well. I ended up donating more money. Jack Daner didn't think it was a big deal and replaced his hours later. The same day I got, yeah. <laughs> yeah, no, I did. Yeah, no, I set it up because. It's something I believe in. I phone bank like four times a week. And like anyone can do this. His advice is to have productive conversations instead of taking off running. And a reminder on the home stretch to election day. It's okay to have a disagreement. That's the cool thing. It's like, that's fine. I have a different view. You have a different view. And I'm not going to get mad about it. Because at the end of the day, if I'm not going to change your opinion, that's all right. They just put that deck on. Trump! Trump! <laughs> Love you! As long as you're staying solid with your neighbors. The Nebraska Democratic Party says it is seeing more people seeking replacement signs at its Omaha office, its Lincoln, and rural offices. We have yet to hear back from the state GOP on this issue today, but the NDP went on to say it believes that the people behind most of these incidents, you could guess it, are teenagers. Reporting live in Northwest Omaha, Alex McClune, KETV, Newswatch 7.